to. Sometimes destiny will lead you into a pit. You won't know how you got there, neither will you know when you arrive. You just wake up one day and you're there in a pit. You have a million questions on your mind, but if you could just get the answer to one key question, like how in the world did I end up here? How in the world did I end up here in prison? When I graduated from high school, I was voted most likely to succeed. How in the world did I end up here in divorce court when I married my high school sweetheart? How in the world did I end up here? Oh, Lord. On drugs when I was raised in the church. How in the world did I end up here pregnant at 16? How in the world did I end up here? You can roll with me now. Oh Lord, unemployed with three degrees. So you end up in a pit. I said, sometime. I said, sometime. Destiny will lead you in a pit. So now, Joseph, he's in a pit. And he doesn't have a clue as to why he's there. But now Judah begins to speak. Judah means pray. I want you to bother your neighbor just one more time for me. And tell him, neighbor, tell him your praise will get you in through and out of situations you would not ordinarily come out of. I don't know your story. Pastor Dylan, I don't know all that you've been through, but I've been in some situations where all I had was a praise. I didn't have any money. My credit was tore up from the floor, but I had a hallelujah. I had a thank you, Jesus. I had a Dream house. 